Hello, and today we're going to be making potassium nitrate. So the chemicals you'll need for this are potassium chloride, which can be bought as a salt substitute, and ammonium nitrate, which can be got from instant cold packs. Okay, so first we need to weigh out our ammonium nitrate. So, the quantity I'm going to be using is 30 grams. So, we'll and that is 30.00 grams. So, and then we need to add a minimal amount of water to completely dissolve it. So, in a graduated cylinder, measure out 25 millilitres of water and then add another 5 with a graduated pipette. So, then we need to filter the solution into a conical flask and your potassium chloride. Okay, so here I have weighed out 30.05 grams of potassium chloride and we need to filter off the anti-caking agent in the, in the, ammo, in the ammonium nitrate solution um, and uh, therefore getting rid of all the contaminants. So. I should explain that I added another 10.25 grams of ammonium nitrate because I got my stoichiometry slightly wrong. So I now have 40.25 grams of ammonium nitrate and 30.05 grams of potassium chloride. So now we need to filter it. Okay, so now the, the mix is fully filtered through and I'm going to transfer the mixture from this beaker into another beaker which is in a hot water bath. Okay, so I've stirred the mixture from the, from the flask in the hot water bath uh, to a point where there is no residue of potassium chloride at the bottom which means that it's ready to be taken out of the hot water bath and put into the freezer. So we'll just get a tea towel ready to dry the, to dry the beaker. And then after you've got the mixture out of the hot water bath, you just want to transfer it to another beaker and put it in the freezer. So, I'll just transfer it into this jam jar to put it into the beaker, to put it into the freezer. And then you've just got to leave the solution in the freezer to cool. And we'll see what happens later on. Okay, so it's been in here for about two hours now. So let's have a look at the crystals. And already you can see a good build up of crystals there, the sort of needle like crystals, you can see them better there, but I'm going to leave them in here overnight to fully crystallise out. Ok so having been in the freezer overnight, you can see a pretty good yield of potassium nitrate at the bottom. So. We'll get, we'll get
get a beaker and we'll decant off the liquid. And there you can see our wet potassium nitrate. And there is my product of potassium nitrate. So I'm going to leave it to dry thoroughly throughout the day and then I'll show it to you when I've dried and crushed the crystals. They are 23 grams of pretty pure potassium nitrate. So I this was a pretty good yield for me because I knew that the theoretical yield was 39 grams but I knew that 13 grams of it would dissolve in the water and wouldn't be wouldn't recrystallize out so I knew that 26 grams was the maximum which means that I've got a theoretical yield of about 90% which is pretty good uh, for someone like me so that's how you make potassium nitrate and thanks for watching please subscribe rate and comment